everyone, and welcome to the second part of the Arrow Racers video tutorial series for the F1 in Schools competition. In this video, we're going to design the ball bearing and the wheel for the wheel system. So let's create a new file by going to File, New, Part, and clicking OK. I'm going to sketch the right plane. And this time, I'm going to take two circles. The first one will have a diameter of 5 millimeters to match the diameter of the axle. And the second one will have a diameter of 9 millimeters. I'm going to extrude it by 3 millimeters. And lastly, I'm going to add some fillets to its inner edges. With radius of 0 0.5 millimeters. Lastly, I'm going to specify the material of the ball bearing by right clicking on material, edit material. I'm going to select ceramic porcelain. Hit apply, close, and control S to save it. Now, we will create a new file for the wheel. Same process, select part and OK. I'm going to start by sketching the right plane and taking a circle. This one is going to have a diameter of 26 millimeters. I'm going to extrude it by 15 millimeters. Then I'm going to sketch its inner face and I'm going to select the left view. Take a new circle, concentric to the first one, with a diameter of 22 millimeters. Then I'm going to create a hole in the wheel by using the extruded cut feature. Now, I don't want the wheel to be completely hollow. In fact, I want to leave two millimeters of solid material on this end. So what I'll do is I will select offset from surface, select this surface, and specify two millimeters. Now I'm going to fillet it one millimeter, fillet. And next I am going to create the base for the axle. To do that, I'm going to right click on this face, sketch it, and I'm going to take a circle. with a diameter of 11 millimeters. And I will extrude it using the up to surface option, and I will select the end of the wheel. Next, I'm going to cut it and create the hole for the axle. This will be done with another circle with a diameter of seven millimeters. And 
Now we'll cut it again using the offset from surface option and selecting the surface. Two millimeters and great. Then I'm going to create the hole for the bearing. So I'm going to wing to sketch this. I will create a circle. With a diameter of nine millimeters. And I'm going to cut it four millimeters deep into the base. I'm going to specify the material of the wheel to ABS. Hit apply. And lastly, I'm going to add a decal. I'll click on Display Manager, Decals, and I will add a decal by right clicking. I will select the file. And I will map it to this face of the wheel. Because the image is rotated, I'm going to rotate it by 270 degrees. Also, in order to remove this grayish color, around the logo. I'm going to go to image, selective color mask, and I'm going to select the white color. Hit OK. And hit enter. And that's it. Thanks for watching. See you in the next and final part of this series.